well show friend this is one cup monday wit wisdom and advice for you in the time it takes me to drink a cup of coffee you get it so last week i read an article about mistakes people make in conversation the author was talking about how frequently one of the first things someone asks someone that they don't know is what do you do the author's point is that it puts a lot of pressure on people to kind of measure up and also what people do doesn't always necessarily correlate with what they're like or even what they like. Is the most fun thing about you how you spend your nine to five? I am so sorry. I try to avoid asking people about what they do for a living when I first meet them, only because I feel like anytime anybody gets asked that question, they instantly all work in PR. Yes! Oh, it's great. You know, every day is great. Think about it. You see people you love, your friends or your family or whatever, and they ask you, hey, how's work? Oh, you know. Same old. Now if a complete stranger asks you, no, it's great, oh, I love it, yep. The people really is is what's great. I mean, I might not do it forever, but you know, yeah. Please, who likes their job all the time? <laughs> Everybody knows that the super negative person is not the person anybody wants to talk to at a party, so then you're sort of forced in to this enthusiasm. It's a mess. But still, when you meet somebody new, sometimes people have trouble coming up with things to talk about and things to say. They're just not really sure how to get the conversation going. And that's where I come in. So this week I thought I would come up with some ideas specifically holiday related, considering that you might be at a lot of work parties, or family gatherings, and you might be around people who you don't necessarily know very well. I'm gonna give you just a few things that I think could be uh, fun conversation starters. Hi, no, you're right, this is a great party. The decorations look beautiful. So listen, if money were no object, how many teeth do you think you'd be willing to lose? Which of Santa's reindeer do you think would have the best parties? Dancer, Blitzen, definitely not Donner. You get it. Which historical figure would you most like to have make you a sandwich? Say, what are your thoughts on the Fonz? Hi, I'm Kate. I made a shelf and wood shop in seventh grade. Do you have any hobbies? Do you know who the Fonz is? You look like the kind of person who likes a challenge. Have you ever thought of how many marshmallow peeps you could put in your mouth? No time limit. Do you think they make new candy canes every year or just bring out the old ones? How much would you pay for a really good moose? The animal. Dessert. Hair product. What kind of moose would a moose eat? the most. I mean, that's gonna get the conversation rolling. And my personal favorite, which always elicits any number of responses, how dare you? I hope you're having a wonderful holiday season. Try that at your next party and report back. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and you can see more things like this. One Cup Monday on Mondays, no teleprompter, no mercy on Wednesday, and on Friday, it's all about the anchor cat with Bri-Day. Until next time. Oh, me? No, I just make YouTube videos. How dare you?